Good morning to all. My name is Sian Kirti. I am studying in 6th standard E section. I am going to tell about contribution technology in education. A word technology is become itself as a in this digital era, it will make our lifestyle comfortable. In each passing day, a new software or gadget introducing in the tech market. Into the education field, it will much advance, it will known by all. In the beginning, there was no books, no books. The students will, will learn to their teacher the their teacher, whatever teachers in the class. Now the invention of paper and pen, the and now we have a new mode of technology and let's see the contribution technology in education. In a, in a classroom there was a educate technology it will make your students make more attentive and easy learning etc. Uh, some students are a visual learner so this so this technology will help to help to them. Uh, some Many software are based in a classroom curriculum. Technology improves in your learning experience. It will help in a higher competitive exam. It is an excellent education learning. It will be well proven in a pandemic duration. Thank you. Hello friends, I am Abhir Amina. I am going to tell about contribution of technology in education. The mode of education was never the same. It has changed continuously. In the beginning, there were no books. Students studying in Gurukulam won the sum of the merits. Books will be available by online, so can be reduced the burden of that by school going. Children distance will never be mattered to gaining knowledge with the help of technology. Today we have many choice to clear our doubts. This will also save our environment by decrease the pollution by burning of paper. Some of the dimmers. This online class will 45 minutes only then so that can be discussion reduced between the teachers and students. The attention of students will get spoiled.
connect with relatives on social media. Today, the mobile phone is not just a mobile phone. It has become a tool to complete a variety of tasks. Developers and engineers were upgrading mobile phone technology day by day. Social media like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter have changed the world of communication with friends and relatives. Promoting our business via smartphone is also a great benefit for today's businessmen. Good for people's safety. We have heard about lots of criminal activities like kidnapping, theft of various things in our locality. So in a different type of illegal activities, the mobile phone help us because it is one of the fastest communication device. This advantages of mobile phones. Sometimes people use mobile phones during driving, which may cause severe road accidents and due to which some people lost their life. Nowadays, children watch movies, play games and cartoons for a long time in mobile phone which take them away from their real life. So keep the children away from the mobile phone and the television. Now we understand the proper use of mobile phones and smartphones. Please use your mobile phones for limited time and use it only for essential works like studying, calling and business marketing. Thank you. Good morning everyone. I am Shweta of Samthiri. Today I am going to speak about advantages and disadvantages of mobile phone. First let me see advantages of mobile phone. Easy communication. Wherever in the world we can easily access and communicate within a minute. It's really a great gift. Who's staying abroad, they can make video call and speak with family members, friends and use for business. In smartphone, we take high quality digital pay and share immediately. Phone is amazing. It's what like a mini computer. We do lot of work in our home itself. Online banking. Most of the banking work we can do at home. Fund transfer, NEFT, IFPS, check cancellation. Online shopping. We, we see thousand plus variety of products. And compare the price, rating, the quality and service. Ordering food online. Ordering food use the app Zomato, Uber Eats, etc. Online education. During the pandemic year, online education is unavoidable. Whatever happened, time and time, never stop. As like that, we should not stop learning. We learn continue. By using Zoom, Google Classroom, we learn in continuously. We see the world in our ad. Disadvantages of mobile phone. Children install lot of unnecessary games. Will offer eyes and brain. Some children play arrogant games and spoil their lives. Is divert from their girls. Children using mobile phone without parenting control is highly dangerous. Most of the app tracking our mail ID, contacts, photos, location and all major details. Without our knowledge, they collect our personal details. Then, we access our bank details. So, must we must be alert. High radiation mobile phone, it will affect our health. But proper usage of mobile phone save our time, energy and transportation. My, finally, my thought is usage of mobile phone is an art. Thank you for this wonderful opportunity. My name is N. Kavya. I am studying 7th standard C circuit. I will talk about advantages and disadvantages of mobile phone. We are living in an electronic age. There are many new means of communication. Mobile phone is an innovative step in the field of telecommunication. Earlier, telephones only served the purpose of communication. 
However, mobile phones have completely changed the concept of the saving. Today, a phone is not only a phone as it provides many other facilities. The cell phone was first tested in 1978. A mobile phone without the need of wiring. Initially, it was used in cars, airlines and passenger trains. But, personally, it has become universal. Mobile phone has become popular to everybody since it is very confidence and uh, the important advantage of having a mobile phone is to communicate to family them and friends not more where they live we can contact them easily by calling or sending messages everywhere which will in this coincidence coincidence in business to make schedule of working using the internet and keep in touches with other companies and marketing moreover we can enjoy various applications like games and inter installs in the mobile phone we can even listen to music or charts with our friends using mobile phone also has certain disadvantage using it over the limit can harm brain particularly of 10 years and young children it can also result in bad effects like blood brain barrier and ear problems using mobile while driving can result is in an accident moreover some mobiles realize radiation that are harmful for the higher heads by processing a mobile phone we can help most of the information around the world are thought after yeah point to mobile phones are not good for our health we must protect ourselves from their bad effects whether usage of mobile phone is wrong or best is completely in our hand thank you